Oh man, here we go, guys. The hell is that? Pyromaniac? Find and kill Pyro? When pigs fly? What the hell is all that? Oh, the, I remember, okay, remember the Crucible. Echoes of the past. Oh, those are all the DLCs. <laughs> I'm stupid. Well, guys, welcome back to Fallout. And my, has it been way too long since I have jumped into this. Way too long. We're playing on normal. I don't necessarily want to play on hard or whatever because things become bullet sponges and it just annoys the piss out of me. I've already beaten this game like three times, so I don't really have anything to prove. The only thing I will do, and that's guys, if you want me to do it, I will crank it up to the survival mode. That's something I've never really played around with. Um, and I think I can change it to survival. I just can't change it back. So just let me know. Um, we're going to do our best to kind of make a full playthrough. I want to... Um, I want to read the lore. I spared you all the beginning stuff. I know you've probably seen it thousands and thousands of times. So we're not going to go through that again. But I do want to read stuff. Of something I've never done. When I played this game, I just kind of play through it. I don't care about that kind of stuff. But now that I've had you guys with me, I want to really understand the environment. I want to understand everything that's going on. So, what we're going to do? Some rat away. We're going to need that. Guys, just go ahead. Grab yourself that monster. And let's do this. I feel like I still remember... Where some of the, like the little items are. Where's that at? This gold watch. See that? Oh, it's in the desk. <laughs> I kind of want to remove the HUD. Kinda. man I used to do all of this stuff on console but now that you can do it on PC it's like why would you ever go back what's up dude As I live and breathe. Oh, I always love this guy it's really you it's me it's me Jessica I'm in here! You're, you're still here. So, other people could still be alive, too. But of course I'm still here! Surely you don't think a little radiation could deter the pride of General Atomics International? <laughs> but <laughs> you seem the worst for wear. Best not let the wife see you in that state. Hmm? Oh, that's a sore subject. Where is the missus, by the way? I can only see her ass in my dreams. They killed her? They... They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers. He's just rubbing it in. Charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? No. He just did not listen to me. They stole him. He's gone. God damn it. Someone took him. Someone stole my son. It's worse than I thought. Mm. This robot's You're so stupid. suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? 200 years? What? Are you? A, a bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give or take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be famished. Codsworth, are you okay? Codsworth, you're acting... a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... 
sir, it's been just horrible. <laughs> Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets our nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing. And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. And the car, the car, how do you polish rust? <laughs> Focus, whoa, buddy. Whoa. Focus, Cotswold. We're going to be a complete smartass in this playthrough, too. I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were dead. I did find this hollow tape. I, I believe the missus was going to present it to you as a, a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. Thank you, Codsworth. Thank you, Codsworth. You're, you're welcome. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The missus and young Sean may turn up yet. Um. Sure. All right. Lead the way. Round two serves, sir. <laughs> What's all this? Ooh. Oh shit. <laughs> Cosworth. He just did it all for me. Okay, you lead the way. You're much better at it than I am. Also, I don't want that crap on me. It stinks. He's getting stuck. Look at it. Don't worry, I'll take care of it. <gasps> he called me Max? Mr. Max. Oh, I love it. He's getting stuck in the ceiling. Sean's out there, dude. Sean's out there, Codsworth. Oh, God. I need to find him. What about Concord, sir? Plenty of people there. And last I checked, they only pummeled me with sticks a few times before I had to run back home. Um. I like these people already. <laughs> oh, good. Maybe you'll get along then, and they can help you find young Sean. I shall remain here and secure the You home. do that, Codsworth. I love how this game is what? Is it 10 years old now? 8 years old? And like, there's still so many bugs. There we go. Oh. Nice. Oh, hell yeah. And we got some cash. Hopefully it's still relevant. You can check mailboxes. Yeah, but there's nothing really in them. So we gotta go to Concord. We gotta check out our house first. See what we can't salvage. Shotgun shells. Silver tablespoon. Slacks. Uh, I know we have carry weight.
carry 240 pounds worth of shit. Heavy ass backpack. Now I think we gotta take all this stuff to um what's it called? The workbench, right? And you can scrap it. And y'all know me, I'm not really a builder, so. But I do like crafting the weapons. Sweet. Nice. Oh, there's a cellar over here. Yes. Freaking doomsday prepper over here. Got aluminum. Hell yeah, gold. I don't think I can actually unlock that one yet. Come back for all this food if you guys make me play on survival for sure. We'll take pork and beans though. Don't think I can pick this. Not yet. I don't even know where we're at as far as level. Yeah, we're level one. The last time I played this, I think I had the mod set. Where it was alternate start so you could pick your starting level location and all that stuff it's been a long time since i've played just vanilla it's been a long time since i've played period there's the workbench let's go ahead and clear the town first try to get everything we can maybe we'll get lucky and we can uh we can level up do something with these weapons if anything get the uh excellent oh hell yeah um, if anything, at least we can get the parts we need to start upgrading stuff. Bottle caps. <gasps> I'm coming, buddy. I'm coming. We're gonna get you. Ooh. Um. I feel like I'm gonna go charisma, guys. Start serenading people with my deep, boomy voice. Right, we're gonna we're gonna make our way around. We're gonna come back to that house. I think there's some roaches still in town. Coffee pot. Yes, fans. That's what we need. We need screws and like um, adhesive, right? Those are like the the two things in the game that like it, that you desperately need. And I think aluminum is one of them as well. You just never really know. That's a tin can. That's not gonna give me what I need. Oh, there's a roach in here. Oh shit, two of them. A little delayed there. You don't swing as fast. Oh shit. Like. You can't. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'll sit there and play with it. I can't do like a click. Like if I just click it, it doesn't do anything. Like you have to actually hold it. I try to remember that. More water. Oh, we got eleven bobby pins. Well, that was easy. Got it. 
<laughs> I pick a postman's hat. A shit ton of pistols. Oh, there we go. Pick that up, too. That's it. never been good at melee combat in this so forgive me i probably still won't be because once we get enough ammo we're going guns all the way can't open that yet i don't know if the fishing rod gives you anything or not pick it up i guess We can make rad roach. I don't really want to, but it sounds absolutely disgusting. Okay, let's stop for a second. What do we got? We got five pistols, pipe pistols, switch blades. A blue dress. But we do need to... We need to level up. I don't know what to level up, guys. All right, we're going to go locksmith first. It might have been it might have been stupid. But I feel like once we get down into uh Concord, we'll uh, we'll level up again. There might be a chance of us finding a weapon that we don't need to upgrade. Maybe. Oop. That's my first one I broke. Yes. Well. Got a lot of, uh, a lot of rounds. There was one more too, right? You better have like a doomsday shotgun in there. pistols more rounds I can't complain right oh, we just got one more house we gotta go to I know it's a slow start I hope you're still with me thanks again for being here I'm gonna jump on the bandwagon and, and play Fallout since everybody else is apparently I don't even know if I want to watch the series has anyone seen it yet sometimes they do such a horrible job with them but I actually haven't heard anything bad about it. This is definitely one of my favorite. Like as buggy as Bethesda is. That's what really just. I think jump started everything for me in modern gaming. Was. Uh, Elder Scrolls. Morrowind. Fantastic. 
and then Fallout 3 was the first one that I actually got the chance to play. You just can't. You can't beat it. Okay. Let's see. Um, now we scrap everything. Or we can, right? Yeah. We're not going to do that right now, though. Right now, we want to scrap scrap two of those. Scrap that. Come on, hold off. Let's we'll see what we can find first before we start building anything. Like we know, we know what's coming in Conquer. I'm not even gonna pretend like I don't. Um, we might get lucky and just get exactly what we need. We can spend all those points in an armor. We got this poor fella here. We're going to take his clothes. I think they're better. Five and ten. They're about the same, but this one does... Looks more apocalyptic. I mean, look at us. Apart from our perfectly manicured haircut, we look pretty apocalyptic. See, look, there we go. We got a rifle. It's nothing fancy, but we're going to equip those. Oh, no, we're not going to equip that. Not yet. We'll need that in a minute. The 308? I didn't realize that. Oh, there's dog meat. Master dog meat. Every apocalyptic man needs a dog. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? He wants to play? You seem like an okay guy. Okay, then. Let's stick together. Let's do it. Can I command hey. you? Grab that. Get that stim pack. Where'd you put it? Sweet. Oh, we found something else. We're gonna scrap a lot of this stuff though before we go. I wish you could scrap things like on the go. Turn that off. What do you see, dude? What is this? Uh oh. <gasps> there they are. There's still one more. We're going to take their food, though. And their hide. There's, like, always one that gets stuck. Oh. There he is. Holy shit. There's a cave down here, too. Maybe it's a good thing that thing got stuck over here. I would have forgot about this. Oh, 
thought there was a gas over here. Yeah, I see it. And then this stuff. I don't remember what you used it for, but I feel like it was important. It's like Radaway or something, right? Fusion core. Mr. Benson, on behalf of the Boston Regional Office, I would like to congratulate you and your team on winning the 2076 Trash Busters Award for the greatest year-to-year -year waste reduction by a single store. Respect for the environment is an integral part of our corporate image, and we appreciate your innovative efforts in this regard. Sincerely, Gerard Phillips, Vice President of Boston Regional. Yeah, they won an award and they're literally just hiding everything underground. Oh, so we don't have a flashlight, we just have this. Bourbon, yes. Oh, come on, I really want a shotgun. So I'm gonna pick everything up. We're gonna have to drop everything back at the uh, Red Rocket, and um, might be sleeping at Red Rocket tonight. Sweet. We're still good on weight. I just want to drop everything and scrap it, so we have nothing but parts. I'm trying to remember what glowing fungus was. If something told me, pick it up. I think you've got to use it for Rataway. Or something like that. I don't I could be completely wrong. We're gonna find out. I think I am gonna turn survival mode on. Oh, uh, yep. Oh, shit. I thought I shot both of them. There might be actually a baseball bat in here. There is? Yes? Stuff upstairs too. There's a bed. Yep. A place for us to rest our head for the night. Bobby pins. Please give us a solid gun. Yes. Oh, just more rounds. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah, I hear him. Oh, there we go. Okay. Um... Don't necessarily want to use this yet, but okay, I suck. Let's just go back to the pistol. I have to just a little short range. Short pipe. Oh, wait, that's what I needed. The pipe rifle. Lock tight. And can't get that one. 
This is what we needed. Yes. Another chess piece. Hey. No. That didn't work out as, as pretty as I thought it was going to. Hey, up here, on the balcony. I've got a group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, okay. please! <laughs> oh god, that was not pretty. I'll pick up all these uh, leather things, though. Actually, I can probably take his leather outfit, too. Okay, dog meat. That was it, right? Okay. <laughs> it's gonna take us a minute to get started, guys. Oh, no, I want this thing. I want his flannel shirt. I'm sorry, man. I didn't want to leave you naked, but uh, I need your clothes. I like flannel. <laughs> Look at us. The hat's stupid. All right, we're going to try out this laser musket, too. This thing. I know there's another one in here. I swear to God, I hit the trigger like four times. <laughs> I love Fallout so much. Nothing over here. Yes. Pipe revolver. I think there is... Oh, yep. I actually suck so bad at this game. Nothing. So it's not local, it's not relay. It could be Angus. Sweet. <laughs> it was Angus. There we go. I don't think I'm talking as much as I normally do, guys. I'm sorry. Stuff over here. Oven mitts. Ceiling fans.
Okay, we got something a second ago. This thing. That's right. Beast of an early, early game gun. It's a beast. Thank you, sir. Take that gas mask, though. He's just chilling. Nothing there now. What? Payback time, buggy. Oh! Give me that shotgun, baby. Hush your dang mouth. What's up, Man, Preston? I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. Name is Max. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minuteman. Nice to meet you, Preston. Nah, that ain't it. I heard you needed a savior. I'm just passing through, bro. I'm just passing through. Fair enough. But the enemy of my enemy oh, is my friend, right? And those raiders want us all dead, including you. Clearly. No problem. I've got my own problems. I have my own problems, Garvey. Yeah? Like what? You help us, maybe we can help you. I'm about to slap his face. That's my business. All right, fine. Forget I asked. But we do need your help. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. First it was the ghouls in Lexington, and now this mess. What are ghouls? Ghouls? What are ghouls? Wow. Maybe. You really aren't from around here, are you? <sighs> nope. Ghouls are... irradiated people. Most are just like you and me. They look pretty messed up and live for a long time. God damn it. But they're still just people. The ones I'm talking about are different. The radiations rotted their brains, made them feral. Uh, They'll rip you apart just as uh, soon as look at you. It. Anyway, we figured Conquer would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But, well, we do have one idea. Better be a good one? Better be a good one. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crash vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. Sounds useful. That's some serious protection. Oh, it gets better. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertebrate. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? Oh, I dig. Huh. Could work. It'll work. Provided <laughs> we can reactivate <laughs> the suit. It's totally out of juice. Probably has been for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. <sighs> I guess I'll help if I can. I'll help if I can. 
What you'll need is an old pre-war FC, a standardized fusion core, your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement, locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Already have it. Actually, I already grabbed the fusion core. We're set. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Damn right they Good did. Luck. Okay. We got the fusion core. Now let's talk to Grandma. Ma'am. You're not what I expect a dog you will find in that little neighborhood. But oh, so much better. I don't like the way you're looking at me. He's a good dog. Smart, too. Oh, indeed. Dog makes good of finding folks who need him. And he'll stick by you now. I saw it. Uh huh. Visions. Uh huh. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. This old lady, she's out of her mind. Yep. But it's the chems. They give old Mama Murphy. Sight. Mama Murph, she wants that jet. I'm listening. I can see a bit of what was and what will be, and even what is right now. Uh, <laughs> and right now, I can see this something coming, drawn by the noise and chaos and it is angry so angry what is it mama murphy what is it mama murphy i need more please oh no it didn't work I'm sorry kid but i just don't know the sight ain't always clear Believe me when I tell you, it ain't a radar. Thank you, I think. There we go. Got a perception bobblehead. Get my way. Let's go. A daily log. <laughs> he just went back inside. It's time to F some stuff up. talking too loud I don't have my crosshairs show me that fancy gun up places to be let's go You know what? I'm gonna save it. Jeez, that freaking rifle's a beast. 
Oh shit, yep. Hey, how about you look behind you? How many rounds that thing takes? Give me your stuff. That's why I don't want to play on hard. Those things are massive bullet sponges. Got a whole bunch of leather, though. Who is that? That's nobody. Where's a grizzle? That's all that's left of him. A light. Compensated. He was compensating quite heavily. Pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you were on our side. I'm on my own side, Garvey. That's a shame, man. You can never have too many friends in the Commonwealth. Listen, when we first met, you said you were just passing through. Well, maybe this will help you reconsider. Ain't much, but it's the best we can do. And you've earned it. You gave me bottle caps, but you gave me ammo. I didn't do it for money. I didn't do it for money. Hey, sorry. I'm used to everyone being in it only for themselves. You know, you remind me of my friends. The other Minutemen. The ones who gave their lives for something bigger than themselves. You should come with us to Sanctuary. We could use the help. Doing what? What would I need to do? You'd need to stay strong like you've been. Because... There's more to your destiny. I've seen it. And I know your pain. My destiny? What do you mean? You're a man out of time. Out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. Sean? Where is my son? Where is Sean? Oh, I wish I knew, kid. I really do. But it's not like I can see your son. I can just feel his life force, his energy. He's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. Uh, that's... Vague. Look, kid, I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The site will paint a clearer picture. No, Mama Murphy <laughs> talked about <it. laughs> She just wants her fix? Junk. It's gonna kill you. Ah, shush, Preston. 
We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the site. And our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can oh, hold on, hold on. Worse than... Everybody just take it easy. We're These guys are assholes. Together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June. It's time to Guess go. I gotta escort you there. Okay. Clear the way for you. All right, guys. So here's the plan. I don't plan on staying in sanctuary. It's too painful. We gotta find our son. So I'm gonna help them get there. They can get settled. See if Mama Murphy's got any more information. Then we're gonna find our son. Dude, look at the way the fog looks when the sun hits it. That is an eerie, eerie look. Let's go, dog meat. This is where I found you. This is where we'll we'll make our stand. that fusion core out though we're gonna transfer a whole bunch of stuff in here store all our junk all right dog let's go talk to Preston see if old mama Murph knows where we can find Sean I'm talking to myself Hey man, I'm sorry I was a dick before. I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? I don't know. <gasps> I'm naked? It's strange being back here. What do you mean? You used to live here or something? Before the war? Yeah. Look at before our glistening skin. Before everything was ruined. Even what I'd do me. Before what war? Are you saying... 200 years ago? Here over 200 years I want to rub my hands on his chest. Frozen I'm sorry, I'll quit talking. Most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? My son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. I've been looking for him. Damn. I'm sorry. I hope you find him. Let me know if there's any way I can help. Anyway, I am glad you're here. And I hope you don't mind, but I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. There's still hope in there are Minutemen out there, somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out with the settlement? God. I don't know if I can do that, man. Oh, good. I was hoping for a chance to rescue some more helpless villagers. It's not that people are helpless. They just need someone to give them a helping hand sometimes. That's what the Minuteman is supposed to be all about. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. This one time, Garvey. Where's this Mama Murphy? But first, we should probably put some clothes on. There we go. Much better. There she is. Yo, woman, where's my son? Hey. Sanctuary. I knew you'd join us here. This dog is going crazy. Our energy is tied to this place. 
Stop reading me? Stop it. That's none of your business. Sorry. I know to you it's private, but for me, I can see it plain as day. You leaving that icebox? Waking up in a world that's not yours. The site can help you, kid. It always has answers. Just gotta bring me some jet so I can see what it wants to tell you. God, this girl just wants her fix. Here you go. Here. Already have some. Like a little kick yourself, <laughs> huh? This'll do. Now, let me ride the high to where the site wants I freaking to love Mama Murphy. Diamond City holds answers, but they're locked tight. You ask them what they know, but people's hearts are chained up with fear and suspicion. But you find it. You find that heart that's gonna lead you to your boy. Oh, it's... It's bright. So bright against the dark alleys it walks. That's... That's what you need to do, kid. Follow the signs to the bright heart. Phew. Wow. That took more out of me than usual. I'm gonna need to rest now, kid. Okay. So a bright heart in Diamond City. But I told Preston I'd help him first. Maybe I can ask these people where this Diamond City is. Dog me, let's go back to Red Rocket. We got some things we got to think about. Now Preston gave me just enough information. Let's go to our map here. We can head east. Ten Pines Bluff. If they've lived here, maybe they'll have a an understanding of what this bright heart is. I wonder if I should take this. I feel constricted in it though. Claustrophobic. What can we do? Can't do a full stock yet. I like how putting a short salt off barrel actually takes stuff. We may just leave it for now. We can probably put on a heavier. Like this one. Or this one. Let's make it stronger. There we go. The baseball bat. There we go. There we go. We got our weapons. We're going to help Preston out this one time, then we're going to come back and set up our base camp, and then we're going to find Sean. Hopefully these people know where Diamond City is. It looks like it's south, but... Oh god. This thing's got no range. These things are nasty. Again, guys, let me know if you want me to play on survival. I feel like it was really out of balance, but if that's something you want to see, I will do it. All right, now back into immersion. Ooh, military fatigues. <gasps> yes? Oh, 
dog meat going for a swim. Sounds pretty good. It's pretty hot. Oh, shit. And Preston said we could use caps for money. He said we can use cash too, but it's rare. There's people over here. Can't peek with me, bro. Raiders. These people are everywhere. Another shotgun. Oh, look, they made me a steak. Brahmin. Silt bean. Why you want him, boy? Oh, did they kill this dude? We're gonna have to kill every single one of these guys. I hate bullies. Oh god. Freaking mutated prairie dogs. Dude must have bit his hand off. He had a watch in his stomach. Oh, it's the old radio tower. Be some ammunition in there. There's someone up there. Let's see. Looks like raiders. I mean, these guys don't even ask questions. They just start shooting. What is that? <gasps> A 
I think it had mines on it. I picked that up for dog meat. So I don't know if I'd give him canned food. We can just give him rat. If these people on the outside, I can only uh, assume they're in here as well. Might have dog meat stay out here. Where is dog meat? There you are. Come here, dude. You need to stay out here. Hey. If I remember this place. If I remember right, this place had a small armory in it. Oh. Yeah, right there. Security is too good. I can't open it up though. Password must be here somewhere. Don't hear anybody though. Oh, no, I do. say these people are cowards. I got some. I'm not clearing my corners the way I should. Holy shit. Shit, I heard that gun. Where'd she go? Akak. What the hell of a name is that? I know they kept that password down here somewhere. What the hell? Heavy-ass gun.
I don't remember where they kept it. Maybe this will help. Oh, everything's offline. It's been 200 years. Of course it is. Surprise these light bulbs still work. Maybe in here? That locket's got someone's picture in it. the smartest idea. Oh shit. cell room key. They kept a key down here. Oh, nope. I'm not going near that. about a chem box. There we go. <gasps> yes. a small armory. Alright, let's get dog meat and get out of here. Alright, buddy. We're almost there. Hey. Come on. Let's go. I'm coming, Sean. I will find you. Shit! 